Hey, good morning. Good morning. By way of law, it's my duty to reintroduce myself to you. My name is Anthony Snow, by the way, and I'm actually the founder of Job Fair Worldwide, and today I will be the person responsible for conducting your video assessment. This video will be viewed by millions of our members, as well as our employers throughout our network and interface. Do we have your permission to proceed with this assessment? Yes. All right, great. Today we're going to ask you a few simple questions, and all that we'll require of you is for you to look straight into this camera right here when answering, and answer cleanly and clearly. Okay, can you please state your name, age, and nationality? My name is Lishan Bar. my age, 22, and nationality, Guyanese. All right, great. Uh, how did you become interested in Job Fair Worldwide? I saw the ad in the newspapers, and I thought I had an adequate skill, so I applied. All right, great. Do you have any special training or technical skills? Well, the only special skills that I have right now that I've just completed is an associate degree in education whereby you do different courses. Um, aside from that, I did accounting and I work as a customer service representative. So. Have you ever uh, did any work with designing curriculum? No, I have not. Okay, just, just curious. Okay, prior to coming into our office, you were asked whether or not you have basic computer experience using programs like Word, Excel, and Access. Your response to that question was yes. Is that affirmative? Um, the Access, I don't really know about it, but Word and Excel, I use it a lot. Okay. On a scale from 1 to 10, uh, how would you rate your learning ability? 9. 9? All right. Great. Yes. Okay. Are you currently working in a computer-based environment? No, I'm not. Okay. Uh, can you please indicate to us which programs you currently use and the purposes for which you use them? Yes. I use Microsoft Word. That's basically to do my assignments. And I use PowerPoint, Excel to do presentations at my college. All right. All right. Which college is that? Sarah College of Education. That's a teaching institute? Yes, it is. All right. Great. Here in Guyana? Yes, it is. All right. Great. Uh, do you have a good command of the English language? Yes, I think so. <laughs> All right, great. Uh, can you just please read this following paragraph out loud? Of course, you don't have to look at me while you read it, <laughs> but just read it loud and clear for us. As mentioned in the opening article, Gregory suffers from an anxiety disorder. My excessive worrying was out of proportion and out of control, he says. How did Gregory regain control? To get perspective, he says, I accepted the kind help of my wife and friends. I also sought professional assistance and learned more about my condition. After making some lifestyle changes, I began to feel that I was in control of my condition. Not that it was in control of me. Although I still experienced a bout of anxiety, I now have a better sense of what triggers them, and I know how to manage my disorder. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay. Next, do you have a general understanding of mathematical concepts? Yes, I do. Okay. You'll be asked a series of second grade level math questions <laughs> and given approximately five seconds to answer each. Okay? Uh, just to indicate to you, second grade level is in U.S. standard, meaning children of the age of seven years old answer these math questions within five seconds. So, right? Wow. So it's relatively easy questions. Things that you should know. Right? I Simple hope so. Addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. It's just a common mathematical assessment. All right, are you ready to start? Yes, I am. All right, 120 plus 120. 240. Okay. 1,000 plus 8,000. 
Zero. Fifty divided by ten. Five. Two hundred and fifty divided by five. Fifty divided by five. Um.
one that, that I'm most interested in is to become an Yes, sure. Uh -huh. 